Hello everyone and welcome to the video of Margi RP in which today we will get to know how you can easily generate your e-invoice by following a few simple steps and can save your time. Firstly, we will see that how you can generate e-invoice while creating the sale bill and then we will tell you how you can generate e-invoice after generating the sale bill. So now let's come and start its process. For which we will go to GST and then click on GSTR settings. Then click on this e-invoice settings option. Then this e-invoice settings window will open with few fields. From here, you will set this field that is e-invoice, Y on F4 key, A for ask and N for no. As A, this means that whenever you will generate the invoice, then the software will ask you that do you want to upload your e-invoice on the portal or not. Then is Y for HSN code, I for item wise and N for no field. This means that if you want to upload your invoices on the portal HSN wise, then you will set this field as Y. And if you want to upload your invoices on the portal item wise, then you will set this field as I. For now, we will set this field as Y that is HSN code. Then from the drop down of select your GSP, you will select the GSP. Like we have a collaboration with Pinnacle FinServe Advisors Private Limited. So in the select your GSP field, we will select Pinnacle FinServe Advisors Private Limited. Then here in the e-invoice login credential, you will mention that username and password which you have created at the time of API registration. After that, we will click on OK button which is given here. Now we will create one sales invoice and let's save it. Here we want to tell you that if you have filled the proper details of your party or customer along with their PIN code while creating their ledger, then your invoice will get uploaded smoothly on the portal without any error. Otherwise, this kind of window will be shown to you at the time of uploading e-invoice and the fields with an asterisk sign are mandatory to be filled. You will fill these given fields as per your requirement. Then this alert window of Generate e-invoice will open, click on yes. As you will click on yes, your invoice will get generated on the e-invoice portal. And a message of e-invoice successfully uploaded will be shown on the screen along with acknowledgement number and acknowledgement date. Click on OK. Now if you want to take the printout of your uploaded e-invoice, then click yes to this wish to print e-invoice window and take the printout according to the printer port settings of the software. And this same process will be followed in order to upload the invoice of export and credit note on the portal. So this was how you can generate your e-invoice at the time of billing. Now suppose if you were not able to generate your e-invoice at the time of billing. So let's come and see the process of how you can easily generate the e-invoice after billing. For which you will press Alt plus M key on the home screen and by pressing enter key on this modify window, we will come to this sales book window. Now press F4 key on that invoice which you want to upload on e-invoice portal. Then from this window, click on e-invoice generation. So this window of e-invoice generation will open. You can modify and save the details of seller, buyer, dispatch and shipment so that the software will not ask you these details from the next time. So after modifying and saving the details, we will click on generate e-invoice from here and will upload your invoice. So friends, in this way, by following any one process from both, you can easily upload your e-invoice on the portal. Now, at the end of this video, we would like to tell you that in order to solve all your collection problems, we have launched MarkPay which will upload your bill by bill payment in Mark ERP. And it will also give you ease from the hassle of reconciliation. It is very easy to register in Mark Pay. You can register it in just three simple steps. To know in detail, we have provided the video link in the description box. You can follow the process shown in the video and can do the registration in Mark Pay. Thanks for watching.